Hello everyone, I am Harshita and today's topic is Cash Advances in Expenses. Cash Advances process begins when an employee requests a cash advance by completing a request cash advance request. After completing cash advance request, if cash advance require approval from the manager, so cash advance request gets submitted for that. And after getting manager approval, if auditor approval is also required, then it is submitted for auditor's approval. Then after getting auditor's approval, reimbursement comes into play. But when auditor is giving approval, one thing auditor needs to do is to specify a due date by which the cash advance must be applied to the employee's expense report. So this is the one thing which auditors required to do while giving the approval. After that, for reimbursement process to start, we need to run the process expense reimbursement and cash advances. And after running this process, payables create a payment request for the same. So this is the whole process of cash advances. First, employee needs to request a cash advance. Then it goes for manager approval. Then it goes for auditor's approval. Then reimbursement takes place. So what we will do now, we will move to the instance and we will request cash advance and we will see whole process how cash advances request flows in the instance so moving to the instance now for requesting a cash advance we need to go to the navigator in navigator go to me expand expenses Now here you can go for cash advance to request, click on request cash advance, give advance amount you want, like I'm giving 100 USD. You can add any purpose, like I'm giving trip, trip and travel and trip. Then advanced type, I'm taking travel only. If you want any other purpose other than travel, you can give other. But right now I'm giving travel. If you want, you can add trip start and end date and give attachment also. But these are not mandatory fields, so I'm not filling it right now. After giving this mandatory information, just submit it. Now here you can say it is submitted for approval. And if you will open this cash advance request. You can see the status pending manager approval. So the manager of the KC Brown is Anita Kennedy. So I will log in as Anita Kennedy. And from there, I will give approval to this cash advance so that it can move to moves for the auditor's approval. So let's log in as Anita Kennedy now. Now, as you can see, I have logged in as Anita Kennedy here. You can see in this bell icon notification is coming of the approval, cash advance approval for KC Brown. If you want, you can directly approve from here or for more details, you can click on this hyperlink. So right now I'm just approving it from here only. Now we are done with the manager approvals. Now, what was the next step? Next step was the auditor's approval. So Casey Brown's manager was the Anita Kennedy and the auditor to whom this cash advance request is going, going for approval is Kelly Wills. So now I will log in as Kelly Wills. So let's go to Kelly Will. Now you can see I have logged in as a Kelly Will here. Now what I will do, I will go to Navigator, Navigator Expenses and Expenses Auditing. Now here go to Task List and go to Manage Cash Advance. Give your business unit, my business unit is US1 business unit and search. Now here you can see that our cash advance request is visible here pending for auditor's approval for 100 USD purpose travel and trip. Just click on this hyperlink. Now, as I have already discussed in PPT, that 
address needs to specify the due date here. So I'm just giving due date like 15 October 2022 and approving the cash advance request. So this is done from here. And you can see that now status is also coming as ready for payment processing. Now reimbursement process comes into play. For that, we need to go to again task list and we need to run the process process expense reimbursement and cash advance give your business unit here us1 business unit give type cash advance and submit refresh refresh you can see that status is succeeded and under payment request one is coming just click on that you can see our cash advance here. Just open it. Now here you can see description travel and trip for 100 USD. We have created this invoice. So this is how cash advances whole process works. First request is uh, first request is submitted. Then manager approval auditor approvals are taken on that cash advance request and after that reimbursement process comes into play this was all about the cash advances thank you